morning. Welcome to Ames News, the happy happening hearts. Stay up to date on the latest news from the Abacus International Montessori School and stay in the loop with the newest developments and important news items. Keep abreast of the most talked about headlines and events taking place at the institution. The inside scoop on the stories that matter most. News spotlights. Learning redesign. Discover a new way of education at AIMS Monday Assembly. Celebrate our planet. Join the fight with AIMS for a sustainable future. Unite and triumph. AIMS Sports Teams Division. Remembering those who lost their lives. A tribute to the departed souls of the tragic Odisha train accident. Learn without limits with AIMS. Discover the world of online classes. Celebrate life's joyful moments with AIMS birthday wishes. The future is what's to come. Get ready for what's ahead with AIMS weather forecast. AIMS leveraging information to maximize your academic potential. Tune in to learn more about the inspiring stories. Learning Redesign Discover a new way of education at AIMS Monday Assembly. The Abacus International Montessori School is dedicated to provide a safe, fun and stimulating learning environment for its students. Since its beginning, the school has been committed to providing a holistic education program that combines both the Montessori philosophy and the advances of modern educational technology. At the Abacus International Montessori School, the start of the new academic year on June 1, 2023 marked a special time for all members of the school community as they got an opportunity to reconnect with old friends and make new ones where teachers start to plan the activities for the new academic year. During the assembly, teachers also have the opportunity to present special awards and recognize students for their hard work and dedication. Reopening its doors after the summer vacation, the Abacus International Montessori School held a special assembly on 5th June 2023. It began with a lively and disciplined march pass led by the school band at 9.15 a.m. and presided over by Principal Dr. Rajiv Rishimangalam who unfurled the national flag as a sign of respect. The assembly was guided by grade 7 teacher Mrs. Shivadashmi and involved singing of the school anthem and national pledge as part of the ceremonial proceedings. Principal Dr. Raju Vishimangalam encouraged the students to be responsible global citizens and inform them of the school's rules and regulations before the assembly ended at 9.30 a.m. The event emphasized the importance of the values of respect, teamwork, cooperation, punctuality and discipline as well as safety, health and environmental awareness. The assembly was a reminder of the Abacus International Montessori School's ongoing commitment to providing a safe, fun and stimulating learning environment for its students. By the end of the assembly, all members of the school community were ready to welcome the upcoming learning experiences with great enthusiasm. Overall, it was a well-conducted and successful event. Celebrate our planet. Join the fight with AIMS for a sustainable future. Abacus International Montessori School recently celebrated the Environmental Day with students and faculties coming together to raise awareness to take action against climate change and environmental conservation and sustainability and their commitment to preserving the environment and educating their students on the importance of educational stewardship. The school also participated in green initiatives such as establishing a school garden and creating paperback exchange between primary and secondary students. Principal Dr. Raju Vishnamnam initiated sapling plantation which was then followed by a variety of activities such as tree planting, slogan writing, 
poster making and seminars to create a meaningful learning experience. Students of grade 7 named me Raghuritvik and Varnika made talks on the current state of the environment and measures to be taken to protect it while teachers let hands on activities such as birdhouse building, art from recycled materials. Students were also encouraged to come up with innovative solutions to reduce their environmental footprint and express their gratitude for the environment. Throughout the day, discussion circles were held for students to express their ideas and brainstorm creative ways to save resources. The day aimed to educate the students about the benefits of protecting their environment and how life could be improved by a concerted effort to reduce our environmental footprint. To finish the day on positive one note, the school finished with a discussion on how each and every student, teacher and parent can make small changes that will have a big impact on the environment. Abacus International Montessori School hopes to inspire positive change within their community through activities such as these and encourage students to become active stewards of their planet and local community. Expand your horizons. Get involved in AIM's extracurricular activities. The Abacus International Montessori School is striving to promote physical and mental wellness among their students as well as encourage discipline and team spirit by introducing various sports and games such as football, basketball, volleyball, throwball, coco, table tennis and badminton. Athletic events are also given importance. The Abacus International Montessori School is also giving students the opportunity to enhance their abilities through a wide range of exciting extracurricular activities from sport teams to musical ensembles and art classes to student leadership, public speaking and theater and drama, there is something for everyone. Plus a variety of other activities such as classical and western dance, swimming, skating, karate, billiards, horse riding, rifle shooting and robotics also put the spotlight on developing student skills and talents. We two programs are available to ensure that each student realizes their potential. Students participate in individual and group activities allowing them to hone their knowledge and skills while strengthening their sense of unity. By engaging in these activities, the students are gaining insights about themselves and expanding their capabilities. The students have been divided into four groups, Sapphire, Emerald, Ruby and Topaz. Each mentored by Ms. Subhashi, Mrs. Nirmala Devi, Divya and Brinda respectively. The groups have been given the opportunity to get acquainted with each other. Remembering those who lost their lives a tribute to the departed souls of the tragic Odisha train accident. On Thursday, the 2nd of June 2023, tragedy struck Balasore district Odisha, Eastern India, when three trains collided in a devastating crash, taking the lives of to 88 people and injured 1,175. The Shalimar NGR Chennai Central Coromandel Express traveling at full speed mistakenly entered the passing loop rather than the main line and collided with a goods train at the Bahana Bazaar railway station. The resulting shockwave led to the derailment and entrapment of 21 coaches of the Coromandel Express, three of which crashed into the oncoming SMVT Bengaluru Howrah Superfast Express. Reeling from the aftermath of India's worst railway accident since 1995 and the most grievous global incident since the 2004 Sri Lanka tsunami train massacre, the India Railways made conference reservation charts for two passenger trains available on its websites and have issued helpline numbers by the governments of Odisha, West Bengal and Tamil Nadu. 
who facilitated the distribution, Chief Secretary of Odisha, Mr. Pratik Jena dispatched three National Disaster Response Force Units, four Odisha Disaster Rapid Action Force Units, 15 Fire Rescue Teams, 100 Doctors, 200 Policemen and 200 Ambulances. To ease the burden of injured passengers, local bus companies offered transportation the civilians generously offered water and helped with drive luggage. In a show of solidarity, the government of West Bengal sent 30 ambulances with 40 medical personnel. The government of Tamil Nadu sent a high-level delegation with two state ministers to Odisha and organized a treatment facility of 70 beds at Chennai Sajiv Gandhi Government General Hospital. Meanwhile, the Indian Railways declared a 10 lakh rupee and 2 lakh compensation package for families of deceased and severely injured persons respectively. Prime Minister Relief Fund promised ex gratia of 2 lakh to the families of deceased and 50,000 to the injured. Indian Prime Minister Sri Narendra Modi and other local and global leaders expressed their sorrow for the lives that have been lost, with Union Home Minister Amit Shah honoring the deceased and wounded with an outpouring of condolences. The Abacus International Montessori School paid its respect to those who passed away, expressed its sympathies to their families, and prayed for those injured in this case. Catastrophe. A moment of silence was observed in honor of the deceased and the older by the staff and students of the school. On this somber occasion, the school wishes to honor the deceased and wounded with a moment of silence. Without limits with aims, discover the world of online classes. The reopening of school in Tamil Nadu has unfortunately been postponed due to the scorching heat of the sun. The move has been taken in order to safeguard students and teachers from the hazardous thermal conditions. The appropriate time for the reopening of school is yet to be determined. To minimize the risks of sun heat and UV rays, the government of Tamil Nadu may also consider implementing a number of safety measures and precautionary steps such as providing adequate shade, using protective clothing and outdoor environment, setting up temporary structures, awnings or umbrellas and ensuring ventilation in all classrooms and school buildings. The government has issued the guidelines that the school prism premises must maintain insulation from direct exposure to sunlight and that the ambient temperature of the school must be monitored regularly. In the meantime, schools are encouraged to utilize digital, digital tools and online resources to continue offering a quality education for students during the extended break. The government has also announced that they will continue to monitor the situation and decide the re rejuvenation of the school system at a later date. Therefore, Abacus International Montessori School has announced the commencement of online classes for students from grade 6 to 12. Under the directions of Mrs. Manju and Mr. Surak, the coordinators of secondary and senior secondary levels, the school would like to extend a heartfelt thanks to all the MCNs and their parents for taking part in the online classes and increasing their awards during these uncertain times. Celebrate life's joyful moments with AIMS the delicious. Let the birthday celebrations begin. Families and friends can come together to honor the special persons of the week with uplifting and cheerful birthday songs performed by the Ames Choir. 
Celebrate the joyous occasion with delightful gifts and warm wishes to make their special day even more meaningful. Put smiles on faces and lift spirits with our cheerful, upbeat birthday songs. Experience the merriment of the festivities with delightful presents and songs of appreciation. Let us make the birthday celebrant feel extra special and loud with heartwarming tunes and heartfelt gifts. With joy and joy, come join us in sending joyful birthday wishes to the deserving persons of the week. The future is what's to come. Get ready for what's ahead with AIM's weather forecast. The overall weather forecast for the week in Tirupur looks mostly sunny and clear with minimal rain chances. The temperatures are expected to range from a low of 22 degrees Celsius to a high of 33 degrees Celsius with overnight lows around 22 degrees Celsius. Winds are expected to be light and variable with some gusts up to 15 km per hour. Humidity level will remain high with the average relative humidity ranging from 65 to 80%. This week in Tirupur can expect mostly sunny conditions throughout the week with temperatures ranging from the high 70s to the mid 80s. There is a small chance of light showers or thunderstorms in the afternoon each day mainly towards the end of the week. Rain chances are minimal with 0 to 3 mm forecasted for the week. Humidity levels are expected to remain in the moderate high range. Winds will be light to moderate from the northeast. Overall, it will be a mostly sunny and hot week in Tripur. Aims leveraging information to maximize your academic potential. The Abacus International Montessori Schools Linguistic Club is holding a Tamil speech competition on 19th June 2023, headed by Tamil teachers Mrs. Subalakshmi, Ahila Devi, and Nirmala Devi. Participants have been split into six groups according to grade and will be tasked with delivering speeches on pre selected topics such as. எனக்கு பிடித்த விலங்கு உணவே மருந்து உலக வெப்பமய மாதலால் ஏற்படும் மாற்றங்களும் தீர்வுகளும் இந்திய காலகட்டத்தில் தொழில்நுட்பத்தின் முக்கியத்துவம் செயற்கை நுண்ணறிவு நீட் ஏற்றெடுக்கும் துறை விஷிங் ஆல் த ஏஷியன்ஸ் த வெரி பெஸ்ட் ஃபார் அ ஸ்பீச் காம்படிஷன் திஸ் வீக் வி ஹாவ் ஹைலைட்டட் சம் எக்ஸைட்டிங் நியூஸ் Stay tuned for the latest developments, updates and upcoming events and more from Abacus International Montessori School. This is Sonal Shri, this is Samira, signing off. We look forward to seeing you next week. Thank you.